Good morning guys. It is April 10th on this Tuesday morning. Um, what I've got going on this morning is I'm going to look at a trailer, an open trailer. It got me thinking about an open trailer just because I miss my open trailer but the open trailer that we got that was open was more for skid steer and then we bought the enclosed trailer for because we were running out of room uh, for our mowers and stuff and we just didn't have the space to store it in as well and so we used we bought the enclosed trailer to have that room been using it for the last for the last year uh, for our mo for our last year mowing season and it's been storing our uh, mower equipment as well We are here at Zach Sales and Services in Sherburn, Minnesota. Just got here. And he's got the trailer right in front of the shop here. Check it out. How's it going, Zach? Good morning. So this is it, huh? This is a 2 Yeah, it's been about two weeks. Bifold adds you about five seconds. Uh -huh. Function just like a full size ramp, but it's not up in the wind sailing on you. Right. Which it also then it helps with stressing of the trailer. Um, but the only issue you ever have with this trailer is you wear these barrels out that these hooks go into because you got a steel hook uh -huh. in an aluminum barrel. Once every five years, you have to put a new one. Up. Okay. Um, a lot of big upgrades. To this style trailer since it came out number one they went to a two by two railing system so you can tie to the railing you can mount your tools to it a little better my green touch with those uh, racks would go on this should be able to bolt right to it yep um then they went to stake pockets instead of d-rings so you got stake pockets down the side to run a strap to to hook down to or over the rail tie to the rail um a lot of landscapers and mowers are liking the side ramp uh -huh. springtime they got a four-wheeler with a sprayer system or a mower just with the sprayer system that sits there okay. and then they got two riding mowers on the back and so then they don't have to pull both mowers off when they're at a right. job that they're just gonna spray okay. same thing that you know that it's right there ready to go um, okay. lawn care as far as push mowers go some guys are using the side ramp just for push mowers. Okay. I want to actually. So it saves time. Okay. I want to actually try the back, fold, unfold this back here. So it just. So what I do, I'll reverse it here. But I go up with it like it's a straight ramp. Right. I lock this J hook. I go down with the ramp. Lock the rubber boot. J hook. Boot, and I'm ready to go. Okay. And so then you just reverse that, reverse you, that. and you go down one side to the other. So, so I pull the rubber. Pull the rubber first. Yep. Yeah. And then I pull the J hook. And then I go to the other side and pull the rubber and put the J up. And I put my pressure forward as I pull that last hook and then I go down. Step you're adding there is just happening to flip it up and pull those two rubbers. Right. Oh, I was gonna say that's just down lower. Yeah. Well, and we're sitting on a hill here. Okay. So it's a lot better angle. Right. Our bad boy mower and our John Deere zero turn go up this style trailer all day long, no issues. Okay. This is the widest you can get, 82 inches. Um. So 72 inch deck's gonna fit. So and then when I go up, up, I go up just like a straight. I grab it down there. Yep. And then I lock my pin. Once I have my first pin in, then I fold it. And then you fold it. Yep. And then I, what I see is that I don't have to go back to each side and do something different and make my way right. around and I'm back in the pickup. Good 
just gotta get used to it. You get used to that extra step of flipping the ramp up, but it goes pretty effortlessly because as you're pulling that and flipping it up, it's coming down. Okay. So it really, it isn't a time consuming deal. Right. Electric bolt brakes on both axles. Okay. Um, gonna be the same brake as your enclosed trailer. Gonna be the same rim and tire as your enclosed trailer. Okay. All the same light, same coupler. All right guys, so there it is. Looks pretty nice. It's a silver to silver, black. All right. Yep. They just inlay the black inlay there. Black. Yeah. Makes the aluminum pop out a little more too. Mm -hmm. That should do. Perfect. Okay. We'll get those swapped and ready to go. All right, man. All right, Zach. Appreciate thank it. Thank you. And yeah, we'll, I don't know, end of this week or so. That'll be fine. Okay. I'll tuck it back out of the way. Okay, thanks. Yep. All right, guys. So here it is. New trailer. Gonna We're going to be putting the black rims on there so. oh yeah can't forget that so. there it is got some nice box so. yeah. we will be getting it picking it up end of this week so i am excited i am excited yeah Good morning guys, it is April 11th and this morning I'm going to go pick up our new trailer guys. I went to look at it yesterday or day, yeah, I went to look at it two days ago, bought it and I wasn't going to bring it home, but uh, now, okay, but I'm going to go and pick it up at Zach's sales and services the reason why I didn't bring it home the day I bought it is because he was gonna put the rims on with no rims on it oh, take this out. oh man that broke what happened there oh. okay. talking more snow this weekend guys this weekend and so but it's supposed to be warm through this week today's Wednesday look at the geese they're all coming back um, I'm excited just to go, go and uh, pick that up so I'm gonna use this dually actually and go pick it up I am gonna take you guys with um, we're, we're taking the plow with on this one That's going to turn into our landscaping tool um, storage and we can haul it to job sites so that way we're not running back and forth you know we run back and forth to the shop quite a bit I got the opportunity to just uh, go back to the uh, open trailer because we liked it we I missed it we had we used this enclosed trailer for a year and we hauled around our, our mowers um, for one season um, the good thing about it is that you can you know you can store all the mowers and equipment in there as well and you just pull up end of the day park it don't have to do much um, unload or anything but uh, the 
downside was that um, it was just it just felt for us for me um, it was like we can like when we need to fill up um, you you had to take out the mowers every time on the enclose here we just drive up to it fill it up and it's just open you know it's just open and that way the it's it's not hot in the trailer you know when we mow in the hot seasons and um, and it just it's it just I, th I think it just looks nicer with the open trailer as well you know so there's the pros and cons you guys about the trailer you know open and enclosed so there's no right or wrong and so I'm happy if we went back to it. Um, yeah, we used to run that, that skid, this homemade trailer right there with our, um, with our lawn care equipment hooked up to it. We ran that for years. It's a heavy, heavy trailer. That one is, that's a homemade. So now we're just upgrading a little bit. And um, I'm excited to show you guys the setup once we get rolling. And yeah put what you guys think you know what you guys what's your thoughts you guys on enclosed or open trailer um, what do you prefer you know I've, I've had both I've had both so for what we do and in our area I prefer the uh, open trailer so yeah it's nice it's got this a nice little tool box so we can keep anything in there we need to yeah and I'll stain that and then paint that so so that way it's protected and doesn't get too uh, doesn't get uh, beat up too bad so. but on that guys let me know what you guys think um, so I'm excited guys I'm excited